Last week, I covered some Topspin 2K news on a big gameplay update that's going to affect the server mechanic completely and get rid of the wide serve once and for all. At that point, we were not told when the update is going to drop, but I have that news for you today. And some more details about how exactly the serve is going to change. Let's check it out. I thought it was going to be coming out maybe before that um, that E-Champion event that, that, that got held over the weekend, but you did not see it then. Oh yeah, you guys in the comments, let me know if you guys played in it, how you guys found it. One thing I found funny about it was the rule book that got um, shared around. But in the rule book, it said something like, it said something that you can't use um, your my, your you're my player, you can only use the pros and you can't use Sharapova or Serena or something like that and you also can't be wide serving. It seems like the game's issues are um, commonly known for sure. Right, I ain't gonna stall y'all today, um, the patch is gonna come out on Monday the 15th of July so that is what, one week from now. There's also some more news on how the serve's actually gonna change. So what it says here is that the serve attribute will play a bigger role in the outcome, power and specific decision of each serve. All right, that's what we were expecting, which is which is good to see, man, because I've seen a lot of people complaining about it. So it's good to see that finally these issues are getting addressed. Hitting wide serves is now riskier. And how it's going to change in game is that the spread is going to be bigger when aiming wide. The ball is more likely to go in the net if the spread extends too far beyond the sideline. This change better represents to add the risk of aiming wide and trying to go over the higher part of the net. Indeed. Okay, da 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 see. Pro about time, man. This is music to my ears, man. Perfect timing window on serves is gonna be a little shorter. I want this also in ground strokes as well, but so like when your stamina is low, the um perfect window also gets reduced. So players are also gonna be slightly limited on how far from the center of the court the server can move before serving. Oh, so like you can't like move your player all the way to the edge, all the way to the um, tram line. You can, I don't know if that's needed, but if it just ends wide serves, I'm all for anything, <laughs> please. And the final thing is that sliding swing animations have been disabled for returns of serves. Should I, should I know what that is? Do they mean on clay or is that like where you like sort of almost fall over? when you return a serve. Okay, we also have more updates that's gonna be coming with the patch trap day on the 15th. We're gonna be seeing a my career energy warning. is a clearer warning about chances of injury before starting a tournament with low energy. I'll be real, I don't play career mode. It's also gonna be clay court adjustments where they're gonna remove sliding animations when returning serves on clay courts. Is that what I just, is that, the, is that the same thing? Also resolved concerns associated with hiring a coach. Okay, didn't know that was the issue, I'll be honest. And, and also gonna be enhancing performance for Steam Deck users. I'll be real, I don't know who's on a Steam Deck, but if you are, you're a trooper. Yeah, and that's basically all the details that are going to be changed. In the comment section, let me know what you guys think about it. Are these the changes you wanted? For me, wide serving was the biggest like thing that was sort of forced me out of the game, if you know what I mean. So it's great that it's finally going to be, um, you know, adjusted and we're going to be seeing and, and it's going to make the gameplay a lot more enjoyable.